Mr. La Follette. Uh, firstly, Pete La Follette Park Street, I just have a question on the, um, the litigation uh, mechanism. When it's litigated, what, what's the billing process? Does the money come out of the general fund to pay the attorney? Because if it does, it depletes, it depletes what's a, a scarce reserve. Does the money come out of insurance money set aside for litigation? Because if it does, if there's repeated litigations over and over again, which there has been recently, doesn't that increase premiums? So your, pre your premium payment to keep your insurance agent to protect yourself financially keeps going up and up. And doesn't that money ultimately come out of public coffers anyway? So how can we keep this from just snowballing and continuing to happen? It's, it's really a, it's a expensive um, exercise in futility. I, I just don't get it. Um, I just had a real qu quick comment about Mr. Wapner's uh, questions on the conflict of interest. Um, I've done some research there, and I find some really strange coincidental relationships myself with some of you that sit on the board and the, the county commerce bank that just happens to specialize in real estate acquisition and development. So perhaps we can have a public meeting or public forum, and then you, as council, people would be invited to attend an open meeting with honest dialogue with all of us. And perhaps we could reach some sort of answers to these festering questions that just don't seem to want to go away very easy. But oh, just food for thought. Thank you. <laughs> Mr. Mayor. Yes. I would like to respond and set the record straight. For months, we have been accused of having conflicts of interest, of having under the table dealings, and I would like to set the record straight. I think what you're all suggesting, and I'm happy to tell you, it's no, it's certainly public record. My husband, Gary Horgan, is a banking attorney. That's what he's done for 35 years. He sits on the board, he serves on the board of directors of County Commerce Bank, which is in Ventura County. Now there it is. So if there's a conflict of interest, if there's something that I've done, I'd like to hear about it. So please bring forth specific suggestions or specific accusations because there are none. That is the truth. My husband sits on the board of a bank in Ventura. Thank you. <laughs>